A special treat today for children with hearing impairment. The Minnesota Children's Museum teaming up with a local deaf school to make their exhibits more inclusive. Bab Santos is in St. Paul tonight, and so Babs, the event was very well received. Very well received, and actually sponsors stepped up to offer free entry today to many of those families who came through those doors behind me. This is a huge, fun way to see the eyes open in our community that this is what deaf people look like, this is what deaf people do. Inside Minnesota's Children Museum, on Sunday, organizers here teamed up with the University of St. Thomas to give these kids from the Metro Deaf School memories to last a lifetime. We have a lot of kids here, it's very busy, there's a line out the door. Hamburger! With a sign language interpreter on each floor. Delta, airplane. Sunday was the museum's first ever deaf day, a partnership allowing deaf and blind children to experience all the sights and sounds that this place has to offer. We love this. This is amazing. She was very, very excited. Hot dog. An experience just as uplifting for their parents. Deaf day brought on a range of new feelings for these families that normally would just feel left out. The instructions and videos in these exhibits typically more challenging for those with hearing impairments. But now, tree frog. And rather being isolated, they're around deaf individuals and they're being exposed to sign language. It's great. These opportunities are so important because she doesn't have a lot of peers in her neighborhood. Sarah Clarstrom and her daughter Nora made the most of the hands on activities, plus storytelling, sign language lessons, and more arts and crafts. It's amazing because she has the language to help her out. She can have the same experience as every other kid. And the Metro Deaf School says it hopes to do more of these events, not only back here again in the future, but at other locations around the Twin Cities so that everyone who calls the Twin Cities home can appreciate and enjoy all that it has to offer. Live in St. Paul tonight, Babs Santos, Fox 9. Yeah. Great exhibit. Thanks, Babs. Well, after